The thoughts and opinions expressed in this video are entirely my own and are not representative of Sega, any of its studios or brands. I do not work directly on Sonic the Hedgehog, nor am I privy to any advanced information. I am just one of the biggest fans in the world, living out my dream of working at my favourite publisher. With that being said, let's get on with the video. Hey guys, we are back for another reaction video, trailer 2 of Avatar The Last Airbender for Netflix. I am so hyped for this. It's like a month away, less than a month away now. But we got this trailer, we're going to watch it together. As always, slap a like on it, hit the subscribe button. Really do hit the subscribe button, it really helps me out. Netflix are no way going to let this fly. They will take all the money from this. So, if someone from Netflix is reviewing this, and you want to let me have my reaction back, that would be great. But that subscription, it costs you nothing, and it does more than you can know. So, please do me a favour and hit that subscribe button for me. And let's get into Avatar The Last Airbender, trailer 2. Okay, so, standard procedure, we'll watch it once, then I'll do a second run through where I pause it and point out things I've noticed and things like that, so, let's do it. The Fire Nation is embarked on a dark path. And the world might never recover. Okay. The world needs the Avatar. Yes, it does. Yes, it does. Is that Iroh? It needs you, Aang. The boy in the iceberg. Oh, that music. The Fire Nation has destroyed everything in their path. Okay. Looking cool. If the world is going to have any chance, it's going to need Aang. I believe Aang can save the world. Yo, what? Right. There goes the savior of the world. Soccer. Oh my god, I think Soccer's gonna be on point. I chased down Iro. the Avatar. Zuko, I love the Fire Nation outfits. Here's your destiny, buddy. Oh, the fire looks really good. Stop the Fire Nation. I don't want the responsibility. You don't blame you, Aang. Have me, Tara, and a flying ball of fur. What more do you need? Oh my god, he's really soccer. Oh, <gasps> June! Need you. Hey, bye! Remember what it is we're really fighting for. Zhao? The one. <gasps> oh, Marshu! Love. This music. I'm the blue spirit. I'm gonna save the world. With my friends. Yo, this looks so boomy. Oh my jet. Yo, yo. And Oh, the music is just making me emotional. Guys, February 22nd could not get here fast enough. Holy jeez. Let's watch that again. So, first off, I believe this is the Fire Nation army coming to the Southern Water Tribe, probably led by Zuko. Fire Nation is embarked on a dark path. I think this is Yatso speaking. And the world might never recover. Burning forest there. Uh, let me just skip that back slightly just so you can see it. Um, no, I've gone too far forward. I apologize. Yeah, this here. I I believe this is the forest the Fire Nation destroyed. And that's why Heibai is wreaking havoc. I believe. I'm not sure. But I think so. Might never recover. Okay. This... I think this is going to be the Fire Nation's assault on the Southern Air Temple. Which is not something that I think we saw originally. We kind of saw bits of it maybe, but I don't think we saw the full thing. So if they're going to flesh this out, that's really cool. The world needs the Avatar. Yeah, it looks like Air Nomads. I'm wondering if that's Ira. It needs you, Aang. 
Out he comes. Looks spot on. Him stuck in the ice. We, we've got to give a shout out to this musical score. Because it's new compositions of the existing Avatar soundtrack. And it's incredible. The weight and the emotion behind it. Uh, I think there is a chance this is the Fire Nation. Yes. Perhaps it is. Is that gentleman wearing a snapback? It kind of looks like he might be wearing a snapback. And you've got this Charlie from Lost looking guy on the left. Okay. Charlie from Lost. No, not Charlie from Lost. Charlie from Twilight. Papa Charlie. Um, No. Looking awesome. Daniel Day Kim as the Fire Lord. Oh my God. Yes. Loving the look of the Fire oh, Nation so far. Now, I'm pretty sure that was the only shot of Azula we got in the entire trailer. And it looks like she's firing an arrow to do some shenanigans. Um, it, I'll be very interested to see how they flesh out Azula in this because she's going to get a lot more time than she did in the original season, in the original series, because it doesn't really appear until the post credit scene in season one. So looking forward to seeing what kind of role she'll have here. So someone pointed out to me in one of the previous videos, they think this is where Zuko gets, where Iroh gets captured by the Earthbenders and Zuko saves them. And yep, I think you're pretty spot on there. Looks the part. And they're, they're riding the same uh, animals that they are in the show. So that's just fucking awesome. If the world is going to have any chance, it's going to need aim. It's true. And I love that Katara is sounding very Katara, to be completely honest with you. Uh, the actress really looks the part here. So, yeah. Looking forward to seeing how this pans out. That is amazing because that is the opening sequence of the show. Where he airballs into the statue. It's amazing. Amazing little addition there. Right. There goes the saviour of the world. I love soccer in this. Jesus. Okay. Zuko ship. Down every hint of the Avatar. Fire Nation Army. I think this is back to that moment. I'm wondering what this is going to be because I think we've seen the Agni Kai and it doesn't look like it's our side. Um, but Daniel Day Kim looking incredible as, as uh, Ozai. I mean, this guy's in his 50s. I wish I looked like that in my 50s. I don't know about that in my 30s. So, fair play. Really looking forward to seeing what they do with him. Looking like he's going to get a bit more time than he does in, in the original show again. So, love to see more development. Someone who can stop the Fire Nation. See, this looks to be indoors. And I do remember when Zuko got beat by his dad. It was indoors originally. So, I'm not sure if it's the same shot, but... Any Avatar fans knows how iconic this moment is. This is the moment where Zuko goes on the path that we see him on for you know, the beginning of the story. So, yeah, huge deal. Loving seeing the Agni Kai. Let's continue. I don't want the responsibility. Because he's just a kid. Look at him with Appa as well. Hot damn. Look at him with Appa. Just that friendship really needs to be central to the character. And this shot alone makes me think that there's a good chance of that. And dealing with the responsibility of being the Avatar and how he never wanted to be. You know, he's just a kid. Love it. So faithful you to the show. To do this you have me, Tara, and a flying ball of fur. Again, I think this soccer is fantastic. I really do. I think the humour is very difficult to kind of like pinpoint. Because it's done it's corny at times it is corny but it's done through the incredible performance of the original voice actor and i think that's very difficult to follow up even more so in live action and i have a lot of confidence in this guy's potential right now everything i'm seeing from him is really on point soccer what more do you need i mean look at that with momo this oh my god I can't wait to see June. I really can't. The world needs you. I'm pretty sure that's Hey Bye. Looking at the colouring. 
kind of looks like a xenomorph in a way. And it's interesting because obviously in the show, it's like the, the designs aren't, they're not realistic, they're cartoons. So, you know, he's just got smooth skin and you don't really think anything of it. But this looks like a more interesting kind of way to it. There's texture to it in and things that I just didn't think about with Hey Bye. But yeah, I think it looks really cool. This is definitely Hey Bye. I, I can almost guarantee this is Hey Bye. Remember what it is we're really fighting. So that looks like Zhao goes to the Kyoshi Warriors to kick some ass. Which love seeing the Kyoshi Warriors. The ones. Oh my god, Omashu looks spectacular. Holy shit. We love. Yo, no, I love the Blue Spirit. I absolutely love my boy Zuko. And we're getting the Blue Spirit episode, which. One of my favorite episodes. And I'm gonna save the world. Yeah, you are, Ang. With my friends. Ang looks great. Oh my god. Boomy. Looking so on point as well. Oh, I can't wait for this. The bending looks fantastic as well. Like, massive props to the bending. Jet looking cool. And then, of course. Now. I think that's going to be at the Southern Air Temple. When he realises that his people died and it was kind of, not really, but kind of his fault. So, yeah, I think that's where that's going to come in. Water, earth, fire, air. Avatar, the last airbender. February 22nd, folks, mark those calendars. This just looks phenomenal. And I, 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 I've I, said this at like every point in this video. I cannot wait for this, okay? This is going to redeem the M. Night Shyamalan film. At least I hope it will. I'm praying. I can't wait to see it. Um, me and Jess are very excited for this. We're going to be binging the whole thing on the 22nd. Um, I may even take the day off work for it. To get a review out for you guys so let me know what you guys think down in the comments below of course slap a like on there or dislike it if you, if you don't like my content you know like fair enough you're entitled to your opinion leave a dislike if you want people still are more likely to see it with that so hey ho and if you really could consider hitting that subscribe button for me it would mean the absolute world i'm a small youtuber i need those subs so more people can see the stuff so i really would appreciate it if you could hit the subscribe button for me thank you so much for watching i'll see you on the next one bye for now I'm here,